I was so tired all the time. Now, don't touch it, okay? Okay. I think my son was so used to me telling him that I didn't feel good and I didn't have the energy and that I couldn't play that it really worried him that mommy was sick. And I could see the look on his face, that look of disappointment. I didn't want that to be the parent that he grew up knowing. You're in trouble now. And that really was my instigator for trying to figure out what was wrong. got four ounce boxes of apple juice and orange juice because they are 14 and 15 grams of carbs, which is a, a perfect amount for treating lows. So when I was told it was type one, it was kind of a shock. Just the thought of having to manage an autoimmune disease was a little overwhelming. So one of the things that I was lacking around me as a type 1 diabetic was that education and mentorship piece. We can, we can get you set up with our educators and all those kinds of things. So one of the things that I was interested in at EVMS is that the Australis Diabetes Center has dedicated educators as part of their team. Hey, for Mama! Right after I was diagnosed, I started getting him involved. First you gotta hold it up and tap it to get all the bubbles to the top. When I was first diagnosed as a type 1 diabetic, and I came home with all kinds of scary things. Sharp things to poke my fingers and suck up blood. And I think that was a little overwhelming for my son. I have done my best to explain it to him. Because your pancreas makes insulin. What's wrong with mine? Broken in half. I do all of these things to keep me healthy so that I can play with him, so that I do have energy. Him participating in it made it less scary for him and he is so proud of himself for all that he does. You take good care of mama. I'm just so grateful to be able to participate, just to feel alive again, and that feeling of gratitude just hasn't worn off. Love you.